Hello, in this video we're going to look at exporting your medium sculpts with vertex color information to Blender for doing fancy renders or even animation. So to export your model, let me just go back a bit there, just go to File, Export, and here we're basically going to use the raw preset which exports all of the triangles with vertex color information per vertices. There we go. And export, and save a location, export, there, get the idea. And then when you have that file, you can import it into Blender. But first, I'm just going to select all with A and hit X and delete everything and file, import, FBX. And I'm just going to hunt down my sculpt. There we go. And everything is standard, all of the import settings here, import and wait a while depending on your machine. This can take up to up to five minutes I've found sometimes. All right, we have a bunny. Um, it's all a bit crooked and stuff, you know, we can fix that later. Um, but how to get your materials back, just go switch over here to our workbench engine and rotate the HDR a bit. Actually, I'm just going to correct this because it's bugging me. Uh, uh, line it up a little bit. Cool, that's better. Uh, we're going to switch this to shader editor. You're going to select one of the meshes if you have multiple meshes. Create a new material. I'm just going to leave it the default name. Search for attribute and the color information is called vertex colors so we just type that in here vertex colors plug the color into our base color and there we go now we can just do a select all control l and link that material to all the other materials and there we go that's the that's basically it. Um, then you can, you know, tweak other settings to your heart content, to your heart's content, and hit render. And yeah, there is another method as well. Um, when you export, you can export textures and choose your texture sizes, and also kind of decimate the the model down to something a bit more manageable. As as you can see, this. Uh, there's a lot of faces in this model, so it's not going to be particularly good if you want to export it to Sketchfab or a game engine or anything like that. Um, yeah, I'm going to release a few of these videos, I think, uh, based on this little project I made. Um, because I, I find quite a few nice little shortcuts in there that I'd like to share. So I'll see you next time. Bye.